What the fuck even is that thing? Is that one of the original Iridians? Hey, what's up, Borderlands fans? It's Matt here, and this is Borderlands the pre-sequel, and we will be completing it for the first time. This will be my first time playing the game, and I am very excited to be playing. I've heard a lot of good news about it, and the goal for this episode will be to get past the tutorial and start, and to be Flame Knuckle. The character I chose to play completely this playthrough as is Wilhelm, and the only reason I really chose to use him as this playable character for this series is my friends told me that he is the best like solo solo character to play as, so that's why I chose him for this game. So I was introduced to the Borderlands franchise by one of my friends a few years ago and when I got my Xbox I did download Borderlands 3 so that I could play it and that became like my favorite game and so I've just been wanting to play the rest of the games from here on out so I'm really excited to be able to get into this. So I really like the aesthetics of the game. I love being able to just go around and kill, like, go around and kill enemies and go around and shoot big bosses and get the loot from them and stuff like that. Very fun. And then the game itself runs super smoothly on my Xbox. So, so far I'm really enjoying it. I have no idea why these doll guys want to jack dead. I have suspicions. Money. Revenge. That's it. Be cleansed with heat! Uh, kill my 
one of the main reasons why I chose this game to play next was because in Borderlands 2, I really liked the whole storyline with Jack. So I wanted to play this game to be able to discover more about his story. And he did play a, a huge role in Borderlands 2. So what was that? Spoilers. He was the main villain for Borderlands 2. And I wanted to, I wanted to see why he became like that in the second game. So this, that is the reason why I chose to play this game. Next. Better get paid if you bite it. Now you saved my life a couple of times. I'm repaying the favor. Besides, I'm a hero, baby. Self-sacrifice is part of the job. Oh, good, a health machine. I had one put in here after a worker had an accident and uh, lost his torso. Better heal up before you trip down to the moon. <laughs> Might want to grab some ammo too. Supplies over here. We need to get a moonshot container up here. Normally we load some supplies, but this time you're the cargo. Too, was I thought he was just a crazy murderer who wanted to go around and kill him. But in the beginning of this game, it shows, and I have I have the cutscene, that he was willing to sacrifice himself to save me. So my initial reaction to him in this game is different than what it was in Borderlands 2.
I really like the low gravity effect and how you use the Oz kit in this game. Thanks for joining the adventure Vault Hunters. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button for more looting and shooting content. Until next time.